I am John Singer. I am a deaf mute, but I read the lips and understand what it says to me. Please, do not shout. My only friend, do you remember the four people I told you about the last time? They still come to my room every time they can, and they talk to me until I do not know how they cannot get weary. The black man, the young girl, the one with the moustache, the owner of the New York cafe. They talk and talk. We Negroes want a chance to be free at last, and freedom is only the right to contribute. We want to serve, to share, to labor, and in turn to consume that which is due to us. But you are the only white man who realizes this terrible need of my people. You see, Mr. Singer, I got this music in me all the time. I got to be a real musician. Maybe I don't know anything now, but uh, I will when I'm 20. See, Mr. Singer, and then uh, I mean to travel in a foreign country where there's no... We were thinking of freedom. That's the world like a worm in my brain. Yes, no, how much, how little. We'll be free, and these martyrs will then be able to enslave the others. But uh, we who know must be worried. The, how are you getting on with your business now? At first, I didn't understand the four people at all. But now I understand each word they say. And now I know what each one of them is going to say before it begins because the meaning is always the same. Every, everybody needs sympathy. I stood before our home the other day. Other people live in it now. The branches of the big oak tree were cut back so as not to interfere with the telephone wires and the tree died. Also, the cat here at the store, the one you used to stroke and fondle, ate something poisonous and died. It's been more than a year since you have gone away. In me, there is always the memory of you, my friend. In my dreams, we are always together. You have left me in an alien land. Alone.